welcome to another episode of Eat Book Blogs. I'm Clara, and today we have Gwen and Ellie with us. Hello. 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 Thanks, for inviting <laughs> Thanks for having me here. Wait, wait. Before you say, oh. Oh. <laughs> are your stomachs empty or full? Super empty, and I eat supper for this. Eh, for Eat Book Blogs. Good, good, good. You? I never eat dinner yesterday for this. Eh, for Eat Book Blogs. <laughs> 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 kidding, kidding, kidding. I didn't have lunch today. That's all. Very good because I'm going to bring you all to eat zi cha. Buffet. What? Zi cha buffet. Buffet? <laughs> mm-hmm. I love buffet! <laughs> <laughs> we'll see you in a bit. Live Hot Signatures mm-hmm. and it's right smack in the middle of the CBD. Yeah, it's only like a few minutes away from Telo IMRT, so mm. I think it's pretty convenient. Mm-hmm. Menu please, producer. Menu please. Oh, it's Ooh. a la carte, a la carte buffet. buffet. Yeah. Okay, now that we've got a menu, let's order. Food is here! Yay! Yay! I'm so freaking excited. Yeah. There's so many dishes. Like Most this. importantly, we got all their signature yeah. dishes. So there are six signatures, mm-hmm. and the signatures like you only order one time. I think we should try the first signature, and it's called yeah. signature sambal fish. When it first arrived, right, the sambal like the fragrance just like pam, it smack in your face. <laughs> yeah. I would expect sambal to be the watery kind. Oh yeah. Yeah, this is like the dry with a lot of seeds inside. So it's on a promfed fish. Wow. Yeah. And this is the promfed is huge, eh? Mm-hmm. It's quite big. It's like. No, it's more than that. I think you need the my The size hands. of three hands. Four hands. Four. Messy. Basically what I like, right? They kind of cut it up for you a mm. bit. So it's easier for you to just take one piece. Wow, the sambal is like, it's actually quite salty. Yeah. Now it's very fragrant. It's like mildly spicy, but there's mm. still like a slight kick. Mm. Mm. I think the sambal is damn eggy, but like mm. you need a jar of this, yeah. Like I will eat it with rice. Yeah. It tastes so good with rice, eh. I really like how thick the fish is. Mm. It's really packed full mm. of meat, it's very plump. Mm. Yeah. But then they fried it. I'm not actually a fan of fried fish actually. Mm. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. I like it when it's steamed. Steam. They fry it because it, the oiliness and the crispiness of the fish really mm. goes well with the sambal. But I would say that the meat is more on the dry side because it's fried. Mm. Yeah. Next up on the signature, I think it's someone's favourite. I love me some fresh prawns. Mm. So this is their yeah, poached prawns. Correct. Mm-hmm. It's kind of like in a, a soy sauce mm. broth, I guess. Yeah, they're bathing in it. Let's eat. Are you good at peeling prawns? Uh, oh, yeah. Yeah. I know a lot of peeled prawns. Really eh. prawns I heard yeah. that someone likes yeah, to peel Yeah, I heard some, it's someone's paradise. Oh, yeah, yeah, help me all out. Help me all Oh my gosh, you know I got flamed by my colleagues when I ate the prawn cake. Yeah, yeah. what is the prawn cake? No, but I, I feel like the prawn head is one way to know that your prawn is fresh. If you suck the prawn head right and it's sweet, then mm-hmm. that's when you know it's fresh. Oh, guess okay, Kara. Guess what? It's sweet. It, it is, is sweet. sweet. You know when it comes out easily, it means it's fresh. So. Wow. Oh, you want to do the tail meat there? Eh. Wow, I really love prawns. Eh. <laughs> it's so fresh, it's so succulent, it's very juicy and mm. it's very sweet. She's like wrapping the description of the prawn. The sauce, right? It has kind of like a ginger, spring onion taste infused in it. Mm. I feel like this prawn standard, right, is the kind that you will expect to eat at a, like a wedding dinner. Okay, okay, the next dish is just crayfish. 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 And you can choose it in two styles: black pepper or Singapore chili. Hey, the meat is very easy to pull out. Mm. Ooh, 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 wow. hey. Fat eh. Yeah, it's thick. Mm. But I'm quite surprised that for Zita, like a restaurant, right? They have this. Yeah, it might be less expensive as compared to crab, but it's still mm. a premium meat. Let's try it. Huh? Why? Why are we all so small? It's not spicy, which is something that I appreciate. Mm. It's just nice. The crayfish is fresh, mm. but they might have overcooked it a little. But you can tell that they are not trying to hide the meat with the sauce. Next one, my favorite. It's our favorite actually. By the way, for people who don't know what's kung pao, it's just braised pork belly mm-hmm. with kind of like a flour. But it's very braised through. You can see that the meat of the pork totally brown from inside and out. Brown from, from the inside, inside and out. Yeah. <laughs> I like how. Huh? I feel like it hasn't been braised for a damn like long amount of time mm. because the meat is a bit tough. It doesn't break apart easily. Let's okay. try this. Yes. This is a fish moss soup. Hey, another wedding banquet item. <laughs> oh, <right. laughs> it's full of ingredients. Every scoop that you scoop right is confirmed plus shop that's yeah. ingredients inside. It's like the ingredients are trying to come out of your spoon. <laughs> yeah, like so <laughs> 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 Hey, what's that? What's yeah. that? 
What is this? Chicken. Fish. Chicken. Eh? Crab meat. Eh? Huh? Crab. Huh? Wow, eh, the crab meat is so big that I thought it was a chicken eh. I feel like when I drink right, it's very pushing. The last signature dish right is my must order at every Zita experience I ever went to. And that is the... Prawn chicken. chicken. <laughs> 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 I thought you were... No, I like, should I say ha chong kai or prawn <laughs> Yes, come here baby. Who me? No, the chicken. So this is their prawn paste chicken or ha chong kai and mm -hmm. it's also served with their fried prawn roll. Oh, the oh, smell! Wow. The prawn paste smell stands out so much. Eh. And I like that the batter is Ooh. light. Mm. Yeah. It's not crazy thick like a lot of other places. I wouldn't say the prawn paste is very strong though. It's quite mild eh. Oh, it's, it's not like... It's quite strong. Really? To me it's not very strong eh. I feel like I have more like of the chicken taste than the prawn paste taste. But I get what you say by don't have prawn taste. I mm. feel like it's more salty. Yeah, yeah. More I, salty uh, than salty. Mm. Mm. I think the smell is like stronger than the taste. Yeah. Mm. We give that a second okay. chance. We try okay, a second okay. chance. Okay. Oh, you you oh. use the chopsticks here. Yeah. yeah. Uh -huh. We still have oh, yeah. the yeah. <laughs> I like it. I prefer this more though. Mm. Yeah. This one has the my favorite like no ham taste. It's more of a meat roll. Yeah. A bit like a deep fried no ham. Mm. But what I really love about it is that they add chestnut inside. Oh, mm. is it? Crunchy, crunchy, one, yeah. Now that we finish all six, we need to choose which one is our favorite signature mm -hmm. dish. Okay. Say out, uh, one, two, three. Poached prawn. Prawn. <laughs> prawn. Mine is a poached prawn. Mine is a poached prawn. It's just freaking fresh. Mm -hmm. I love it. I love how the saltiness of the soy sauce broth really pairs well with the sweetness of the prawns. Mm. For me, I prefer the fish muscle because I prefer like mm. soupy dishes. This is like packed with ingredients. I feel like it's something more worth for me. Mm. When you come here, definitely get all the signature dishes. Mm. Okay, so we finished eating all their signatures mm -hmm. and we have a lot more to go. Ooh. So you can kind of pick anything you want to order on the menu because it's a buffet, right? Mm. You just have to make sure you finish everything. Yeah, and what's different from the signature and the non signature is that you can order free flow, okay? Mm -hmm. There are 11 categories of food chicken, fish, pork, lala, and sotong. Tam gong, la, vegetables, la, egg, la. they even have the tofu, la. and also rice and noodles. So let's try everything and we choose our favorites. Top of my list, I love the salted fish fried rice. That's my number one. Hey, wait, that's all that's all of our favorites. Yeah, so like, yeah. it's really yeah. good. Yeah. Yeah, it's and I love it when you have the that crunch, the salted mm, fish, the yeah. small bits. Mm. It's really like it goes well with the rice. A lot of places, right, they are sian yin chao fan, right? It's like Yeah, like min min the. Yeah, mm. and it's not crunchy, it's very like too hard to bite. Mm. I love all things pork. I would highly recommend the coffee ribs. But this ribs, right, when you bite and look at it, right? You can see a layer of fats eh. Fats is taste. Fat is gold. Fat is life. And fat, fat is love. <laughs> oh no. <It's> also me. <laughs> for the coffee ribs to get the flavor from not only the coffee sauce, but also the fats from the pork. Yeah. Yeah, and the meat is not tough. It's really tender and chewy. I love it. For me, I like the sambal kangkong. I think it's like a must order for me at every mm. Zuta experience. And I think here it, they did it pretty well. I think the sambal is the same as the fish one. Ooh, yeah. So maybe that's why I like it a lot. Like. Well, overall, right, mm -hmm. I feel like there's one good word to describe this place. What is it? Value for money. <laughs> You're That's laughing at me. Words. That's three words. Value for money got hyphen. <laughs> okay. And I feel like all the aunties and uncles I know, right, they will say, Hen zi le, hen zi. Yeah, yeah. That's true, that's true. Oh, yeah. 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 This buffet right, is $29.90 per person but excluding like service charge and GST mm. but it's $17.90 for child. Oh! Yeah! So I think it's very good for family like, mm. especially when you have kids, they love to eat mm. a lot and different varieties of stuff. We only ordered kind of like half uh, yeah, yeah. Yeah. So I feel there's a lot of other variations of mm. the dishes mm. we ordered that you can try also. Mm. You need a minimum of 4 people to come together to eat this Zita buffet. Mm. But also must take note that right, we cannot over order this mm. because once you over order you have to pay the original price. Not yes. worth it! Not worth Hence, it! I'm gonna finish everything on this table. Later. Right now. You sure? Yeah. Thank you for watching this episode of ebook vlog. If you like this video, you can watch more over there. And don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Bye! Bye. 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 B